And I'm back, baby. And today I wanted to make a video on uh, Blizzard nerfing Age Pals. So Age Pal nerfs. Um, and what do you expect? Uh, my, the, the, uh, the class of Age Pal has been not just bad, not just mediocre, not just a bad healer. Age Pal has been the worst class in the entire game. And even tanks like Prop Pallies and Guardian Druids were better healers than Age Pal. But they're going to nerf Age Pal for no reason. Even though it's not even, I wouldn't even say it's on par with the other healers. I would still say it's under average and underperforming in any, any of the other healers right now. But they're going to nerf Age Pal. So they're nerfing Age Pal. Holy Paladin is, is overperforming. In all content and fractures of time. Yeah, maybe because there's more than one age pal queuing now. So there's, like, what? Like, I don't understand. It's not overperforming. It's mediocre at best. Like, it's performing, like, at a, at a barely competitive level. Like, it's, it's performing like, oh, you can play it. That's what, that's what they mean by performing. Oh, like, oh, you can log on and actually play Paladin? That, that's what, like, it's not like it's good. It's mediocre. You can at least play the game. And that's all I was looking for. But they're going to nerf it. As soon as you can actually play the game, they're going to nerf it because that's what they do. So this is what they're doing. Holy Paladin's mana pools have been more plentiful than we would like in PvP. Guess what? Before this, h -Pel ran out of mana. Within 0.5 seconds, you would lose your mana in the starting room. You literally would not have mana in the starting room. You would go walk outside, you press one holy shock, and you were zero mana. So let's, I'm sure they're going to, that, that's the way it's going to be again. Because they nerfed it. They didn't nerf it by 5%. They didn't nerf our mana regeneration by 10%. They didn't nerf it by 20%. They nerfed it by 60%. Holy Paladin's mana reduced by 60%. So they're nerfing our mana regen by 60%. Like, when they nerf shamans, when they eventually nerf shamans, like after months of them being broken, months and months of them being the best healer, they nerfed them by 4%. They nerfed Paladin's mana by 60%. When they needed to buff Paladins and didn't do it for two years, over three years, over four expansions, they needed to buff Holy Shock by like 200%. They needed to buff Flash of Light by like 200%. And when we finally saw H-Pal buffs, it's buffed like by 5%. And then when finally H-Pal is even slightly playable, they nerf us by 60%. That's just mana. That's just the mana part. Now on top of the mana, then they nerfed all healing by 8%. So across all your healing spells, you're nerfed by 8%. And then all damage decreased by 12%. And then on top of that, on top of all your healing decreased by 8%, your mana regen being down by 60%, and all your damage decreased by 12%, your Tyra's Deliverance healing, which is all your healing, and you won't have any healing without it. You have zero. The only reason why h is viable is because of Tyra's Deliverance healing. That's like all your healing. Your Wings does nothing. Your Wings is not a cooldown anymore. The only real cooldown you have is Tyra's Deliverance. When you press Tyra's Deliverance, you can actually like do some sort of healing. Um, is decreased by 15%. So that's like the biggest. So now, now it's nerfed by, it basically nerfed by 24%. That is, dis it's insane. It's just insane. So this is the last day I'm playing Paladin. It's a joke. Blizzard, it's it's mind-boggling to me. If anyone remembers, if anyone remembers this, you know, oh, two months ago when Rep Pally was broken for like four months straight and people were running triple Rep Pally in Arena and, and, and hitting 400k single target attacks... And they didn't get nerfed for four months straight. And when they finally did nerf them after four months straight, and like the last week of the season, they only nerfed them by like 5%. But yet they nerfed Pally by like 50. This is like a 50% nerf to Paladins, who were already worse than every other healer. It's like, oh, 
it's just like, yeah. like they literally just want to do everything in life to ruin my life and to ruin HPL. They'll do everything to make the game unfun and just garbage. It's insane. Pallies have been so bad for so long, and it's not even like they're overperforming. Pallies are not overperforming. If you fight a Holy Priest, if you fight an Arshame, if you fight a Resto Druid, they they still have a good time into you. It's not like you can't. It's not like they can't beat you. They can beat you easily. So I don't understand. Like I don't understand. It's not like if you face a paladin, you can't beat them. It's the complete opposite. You can easily beat them still. Like if you have a, if they're a holy priest, disprest, they still out. They can still out mana you. Oh, the thing is, when they did this to paladin's mana, they just made us on par with the other healers. They didn't make us better. Now we have a mana pool that is around the same as the other healers. But no, let's nerf us by 60%. What? Ugh. It's insane. <sighs> it's insane. So anyways, I'm going to queue up right now, get my paladin gameplay in before we're nerfed into the ground. Dude, it's just depressing, man. Like, Blizzard just deserves to be in prison. They deserve to be sucking the juice from a rotten communist potato that a granny shot in. I'm so sick of Blizzard making my class pure garbage. This last week, I was like, H Palace is somewhat playable. I can actually play. And I've been playing for every day, being able to play my class. Now it's going to be unplayable again. It's so depressing. It's just so depressing. I can't even think. Nerf by 60%. Like, what is my mana regeneration? It's The thing is, your mana regeneration is already not even good. It's just it's just that you can, like, conserve your mana better. It's not even like HPL mana regeneration is good. It's just you can conserve your mana better. That's why it's good. Like, oh, man. They don't understand. They just don't understand anything. Like, oh... Uh, this is why their game is going to go out of business, though. And, uh, yeah, so if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. The Maestro had to complain a lot about that one. The Maestro's not complaining. The Maestro's saying exactly what needs to be said at the exact moment it needs to be said. But anyway, stream, donate to the Maestro for a better life.